neighbors complaint to the city backfires. Apparently, my current license plate sticker had been scraped off. Any chance the neighbor scraped it off? Well played. Well. Played. Our petty revenge best served toad. If this is a vacation home for them, there are weed seeds you can throw over the wall while they are away. You used to get them from mail order but I don't know if they are sold today never bought them just saw the ads. Nice any chance they scraped off the sticker to you car? Time for cameras. LMAO they kept fucking around and now they finding out. You need to install cameras if your neighbor is doing that sue shit outside your house and to your vehicle. I noticed the one guy on my street who calls county on others for supposed violations had several of his own, so I talked to the rest of the neighbors, and we all called them in. We know it was him, because we'd see him over on the edge of our property staring at stuff and writing notes. Be more subtle, dude. Right now, he's got two broken down minivans on his curb that haven't moved in months. I might call again. We have a next door neighbor who does not like us, for no apparent reason. We let our yard pretty much grow wild whereas theirs is meticulously landscaped and professionally tended. This is 100 the reason. Haters gonna hate. That's beautiful. If you towed them once, you tow them again. Hopefully they learned their lesson. Tow bill on a motorhome can't be cheap. Revenge like this just makes me happy smiling face dot. Dot put a sticker telling me to fix the problem or move it within three days. Why would you have three days to fix or move it, but motorhome was towed within an hour? Gotta score those stickers with a razor. Learned that one living in a lower class neighborhood. Folks be scandalous. I am complaining. This story makes me glad that PA discontinued registration stickers for license plates. Police can scan a plate and get instant verification of registration, so the state decided to save the cost of printing and mailing the stickers. Damn right you should complain about that well done. Be sure to score your new sticker. I'll bet that the local government also really doesn't care for these out-of-area people swooping in and playing God. Wonderful, I am proud of you. Gif Giffy L4 FAUH Lob 3Z0H16M Downsized. That's why you should scour the registration sticker. Please share any update. Dying to know their reaction. Great response to a whole neighbor. Yeah, right. Noise. I'm slow clapping for you. Perfectly done. You have my respect, well done clapping hand sign gold medal. Fafo your neighbors found out. I can't stand it when my neighbor's yard isn't at least mowed and trimmed every couple of weeks, so I get that. But I also realize I can't make people do anything. And you said you have a pretty tall fence covering it anyway, so that's not even that big of a deal. Just a couple of old people with nothing better to do. Do you double space after each sentence? We let our yard pretty much grow wild. Skunks and mosquitoes have a habitat in your yard. My dog has been skunked twice because my neighbor is like you. Maintain your property. Do you not maintain the inside of your house? Do people hate paragraphs? Use fucking paragraphs. Glad you got him towed, but seriously. Man up. Have some pride in yourself. Fix your damn yard. No one appreciates an unkempt home in their area. Normally, I could not care less. Thank you. Dot, thank you, you. There's definitely a reason they pick on you. Do you entertain inflict your music on them? Do something that annoys them on a regular basis? I have a feeling there's much more to the story. So you don't maintain your property and admittedly let it go to shit, then get mad when other people don't like living in close proximity to a dump. Show some pride in your home FFS. No one's saying it has to win the country living front page, but honestly. 
That was satisfying. It's every four in Michigan. Mmm delicious. Eight years in Georgia USA. NJ every four years for their money grab. Please tell me this was in Florida. Perfect response. I could understand letting it go if they had only been mildly annoying, but their constant harassment was over the top. Hopefully they'll leave you alone in the future. IMO no one wins in these Hatfield and McCoy situations. Beautiful. I just want to thank all of you evil, creative people for cracking me up with all the clever revenge suggestions.